Right, so a very quick video for you today guys, it's going to be a little tip on how to have more vivid dreams and how to remember them better. This won't be a complete guide because there's a lot of things you can do for that, uh, but it's going to be a very quick sort of um, couple of minutes video just explaining some things you can do in combination, right? You should do all of these things like at the same time or during the same day in, and it will let you have uh, much more vivid uh, dreams and you'll be able to remember them much easier. So what you're going to do is during the day you're going to go to the gym or go and exercise, do whatever your favourite exercise or workout is and do it as hard as you possibly can, literally like go really, really go for it, exert yourself as hard as you physically can um, and then also during the day make sure that you drink lots of water and, and what it is is like a build up effect of all of these things that will make you so desperate for sleep that when you have it you'll have very nice dreams, you'll have a deep restorative sleep, you'll feel great in the morning and you'll probably have a lucid dream but it's not guaranteed, right? So yeah, drink lots of water during the day and then as you get ready for bed, right, as you get ready to sleep um, in the evening, make sure you have your a, a fairly small meal, like not a huge meal, but have something to eat at about 6 to 7 and then at 7 o'clock when you finish your meal, don't have anything else to eat at all for the whole evening like not even a snack, um, because you want your metabolism to start slowing down um, and shutting down ready for sleep. A lot of people have snacks during the evening. Um, I used to do the same, like, you know, eating all the way through to when you go to sleep, which is all right, you know, I mean, it keeps you going, but at the same time, it keeps your metabolism going. And in order for you to fall into a deep sleep, you need your metabolism to be slowed down, along with your heart rate, your temperature, you need to drop your temperature, that sort of thing. Uh, so what eating is doing, which is great during the day, but what it's doing is it's keeping your system running and it's keeping you, it's keeping the momentum going of your sort of internal systems, your uh, your nervous system, your metabolism, your digestion, all these things that keep you awake and active. So, don't eat anything after seven, drink a lot throughout the day, and then just before you go to bed, try doing some sort of relaxation routine, like an hour before you're going to sleep, uh, either have a nice hot cup of tea, uh, you can have lucid dreaming tea like Guayusa, or you can use herb and mate, you can use all sorts of relaxing uh, tea, leaves, mugwort, there's all sorts of things you can use, and just have a nice cup of tea, read a book, or and a, this is actually a great time as well to go through your dream journal, look at past dreams, and that's it. Just go to sleep and you're more likely to have a very vivid dream. So go ahead, try that out, leave a comment, let me know how it goes. I'll see you next time. Also regarding yesterday's, not yesterday's, uh, Friday's video, I believe, or Saturday's, uh, it was an April Fool's and uh, yes, it was a joke. Um, I like to think that at least a few of you went to bed uh, surrounded by small apples and uh, <laughs> it'd be quite funny if you did. But um, yeah, serious videos are now back to normal and um, for those of you wondering yes I was trying not to laugh as I was filming that one um, I'm not very good at keeping a straight face so I had to do quite a few takes you can see that use like paprika <laughs> uh, and you can <laughs> <this big. laughs> and um <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.